Jasmine and I am back today with another hair tutorial. This is going to be for all my natural girls. Today I am going to show you how to do your wash and go the shingling method way. Basically what it is is you're going through your hair applying products strand by strand evenly coating your hair just to get the most defined curls that your hair can obtain. Today's tutorial is going to be featuring products from Myel Organics. These products have been getting so much buzz over YouTube and Instagram and I was like, I have got to try it out and see what all the buzz and hype is about. And let me tell you, their styling products are so freaking amazing and I definitely can see what all the hype is about. My hair got super defined and if you are interested in what products I use as well as how to achieve the most defined wash and go ever using the shingling method please continue to watch for the tutorial so i'm going to start with freshly washed shampooed and deep conditioned hair and i'm just going to apply the white peony leave-in conditioner I like the fact this leave-in conditioner is in a spray bottle. It makes it less messy and it smells really good and it makes my hair feel really, really soft and I really enjoyed using this leave-in conditioner. So now I'm just gonna separate my hair in two parts. I am gonna go section by section. So I'm just tying the top in a little bit bun to get it out of my way. Then I'm gonna go in with my spray bottle and just regular water and then the moisturizing avocado hair milk. This is their moisturizer. Oh my gosh, you guys, it smells so good and it makes my hair so soft. Then I'm going to go in right on top of that with the Honey and Ginger Styling Gel. So this gel is going to give your hair like crazy hold. It's not sticky at all and that's one thing that I really enjoyed about this product. So I'm going to start doing the shingling method. As you can see, I'm just taking section by section smoothing it out twirling it around my finger this is just going to help your hair get more defined and make sure that each strand is evenly coated with product so i repeat these steps throughout my whole entire head The dimming brush just makes sure there's no knots and also no tangles. So now I'm just scrunching out my hair just to get any of my loose pieces that I have, which are generally in the front of my hair, a little bit more ump. And I don't have any additional product in my hands. I'm gonna let my hair air dry, which takes forever. But during this process, do not touch your hair, manipulate it or anything. As you can see, my hair is super, super defined. So I'm going to add the oil of my choice and get out any of the crunch. So scrunch the crunch out. And it's nighttime, so I'm just going to put my hair in a bonnet and a pineapple. And this is day two hair, which is the best hair. And this is once I took my pineapple down. So I'm just going to give myself a deeper side part and start to lay my edges down. So right now I'm using the Eco Styler Gel with Argan Oil. It is so boss. And I'm just gonna use a soft bristle brush and just lay down my edges. Now with my trusty pick, I am just gonna fluff, buff, and puff. So this is basically how I add volume to my hair. Now I only pick my hair out at the roots just because I mind if my roots are a little fluffy or poofy because the rest of my hair is still super, super curly and super, super defined from the products as well as the shingling method. So these are my final results. I am absolutely in love with it. And these products definitely get an A plus in my book. So as you can see, this is two day old hair and my wash and goes always look better day two, but usually they're a lot more frizzy and poofy and usually I can only get about three days out of a wash and go. 
but the amount of hold that these products have is going to allow me to at least stretch my wash and goes to at least four to maybe five days and that's one thing that i like day one wash and go it's always the worst for me just because my hair has no volume or no body to it. Usually day two, I have to add a lot of product to my hair. And this time, all I had to do was to apply a little bit more leave-in conditioner, get these edges laid down, and that was it. And I'm really impressed with these products, so you will definitely be seeing more tutorials from me featuring Maya Organics. My Sally's holds all of their products so i definitely will be going back to get more thank you guys for watching this hair tutorial make sure you subscribe if you are not subscribed if you are subscribed make sure to hit that bell so that way you will get notifications anytime i post a video i have some awesome content coming to you guys so make sure that you are subscribed and until the next video i'll talk to all of you hands later and don't forget to follow me on snapchat and instagram love all you hands